So, we just got to the first destination, which is the thing, I think it's called Thingvale National Park. Anyways, we got here in good timing. The sun is just sort of like rising. And I'm just gonna show you this amazing view, view that we have because this is insane. Like, this is unreal, man. It's cold, it's like minus two degrees, but we're moving it. Wait, let me just catch a view real quick, yeah? So this is, this is 20 second birthday. This is where he is. Where's 20 second birthday? Have you seen this? Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this? Tell me my guy's not blessed. Listen, yeah. It's blessed. <laughs> Funny too. As you can see, I'm surrounded by nature right now. I'm blessed to see days like this. I'm blessed to see life anyway, but see this. You lot that wanna watch this video, you lot that wanna watch this video. This is your dream destination. You wanna come here. The story that I would tell my kids. Hopefully, if this video stays somewhere, I'll show my kids this same video. Wait, can I ask you something? No, for real, can I ask you? Wait. Wait. In the past okay. two years, yeah, we've, we've both been to like we've been to two cold locations. Next year, can we go somewhere warm, please? Mars uh, is freezing. So yeah, like, that's good Sorry, that you my, mentioned my that. So last freezing. year we went to Amsterdam, and this year we topped it up. So we're going to Iceland. Next year. Fingers crossed we're going to be somewhere in Asia. Yeah, Bali. Yeah. Wait, Vietnam, wait, little wait, Singapore. Wait, somewhere nice and warm. Somewhere that we can not be, get a frostbite and yeah, have a firm here. Don't want to tank. What? No, have a firm here for myself, man. Let's be around. Have a good day, Around this amazing view. It's a blessing, man. It's a blessing. Count okay. your blessings every day. Yeah. Be appreciative that you wake up. Yeah. And you're taking this landing air. Yeah, yeah. No. More life, more. Peace and prosperity, Peace. love and guidance. <laughs> <laughs> so we're at the secret lagoon. I'ma let him talk. You can listen to him talk on his vlog. Basically, basically this vlog. Um. So yeah, we've almost finished the golden circle. 
paint. It's basically finished. We're on like our penultimate stop. Um, which is the secret lagoon, as you can see now. Yeah. So, that's where we are now. As you can see, it's basically a better version of the Blue Lagoon. It's less populated. A lot warmer, a lot, the water is a lot hotter. Um, blue water ain't blue. Yeah, oh, you said that it doesn't have silica. Interesting. Which means our hair is safe. So we don't have to put any conditioner in our hair to stop it from getting dry. Tell you what, it is bloody it's, cold. It's, it's not salty. It's cold outside. outside is like minus one degrees. Yeah, you can feel it here is like 38. Yeah. It's it's less bougie as well. Like there's no like place to get face masks and stuff like that. Like, yeah, it's, just, like, it's, it's just much more water. it's much more natural like nature. Yeah, it? Like, yeah, you feel like in nature. And it's surrounded by like geysers. Let me make an appearance. Yeah, it's surrounded by other like geysers and stuff that are like extremely hot. Yeah, that we can't even go to. So yeah, this is our element right now, man. Twenty second birthday. Yeah, like I couldn't have done it better, and I have to think for better for next year because <laughs> I only go up and up and up. And I said to myself that I will never spend another birthday in the UK until I'm 30. No, here's what's happening for next year. <laughs> I'm gonna Speak get my into existence. I'm gonna get my place in Singapore for a term abroad. Well, a term abroad is, it extends to be actually like six months. That I'm gonna be in like Singapore or that side of the hemisphere. And what's gonna happen is both of these boys are gonna come and visit me for his birthday because he likes traveling on his birthday. So rather than traveling on his birthday and me meeting them wherever, they'll come to me. You see me? Remember this, remember this number, yeah? That's the date today. Jeez, That's my birthday. What? Oh, 26. 26. I was thinking why you count, like count your blessings, guys. Always count your blessings. Don't let, don't be ungrateful in this world. Whatever it may be that you get given or get gifted or receive or walk into or find, just appreciate it. This holiday has taught me that, just appreciate the finer things in life, like nature. I've never been one with nature, but I've started to understand that there are points in the world that I just, like pictures can't do it justice. You cannot do it justice. You cannot feel what I feel through this video. That's the, that's the important part. There was a point, oh, when we was bad at, so we did a makeup vlog, I think. Oh, did we? We was bad at Jesus, G, 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 Please do so. I don't know why I turned into a spiritual motivational speaker about nature, but yeah, man, this is a little thing about our birthday. So let's end it. So the last bit of the golden circle. We've enjoyed our little hot pool. We've come to a cool, it's called the Kerid Crater. That was very enthusiastic. This is the excitement. Massive, massive crater. Hate to get in here. As you can see, you can climb to the highest point. And you can also go to the lowest point, which is near the bottom of the pool of water. So we'll get some perspectives from down there and up there. But this is immense, massive. So we come to the last, last spot of our day and it's beautiful here. Like candy floss looking sunset. It's the, it's the, it's the what's it called, the crater. And it's unreal, look at, look at this. This is beautiful. Beautiful. So now we've made it to the peakest point of the crater. Ooh. Someone is here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of terrifying, although we're like fully safe. It's so high up, man. As you can see. And the sky looks like candy floss. Huh? The sky looks like candy floss. Not on Mars. Very high up. It's very cold, and then we'll be we'll some in some time be down. There's people there. But yeah, it's fucking crazy, man. Should we start making ways down? Should we start making ways down? Come here, anywhere cold, bring a pair of spare socks. He's wearing boots. We're not stopping right now. Freezing cold.
Oh, it's very cold. Oh, so let's start making our way down, yeah? Making our way down. Oh, my trousers dirty. Huh? That's like another crate. Which way do you want to go? Huh? You go down that way? Let's just go this way, man. So we're walking around the crater. <laughs> Alright boys, summarize, summarize your trip to Iceland in like one word. Huh? Summarize your trip to Iceland in one word. Or two, three words. Absolutely. Beep. Unbelievable. I would say transdimensional. I said transdimensional. Hashtag that. Otherworldly. Otherworldly? Yeah. And I just went for the basic absolutely Gosh. effing unbelievable. Couldn't describe this country in three words. Unreal. No. What a way to spend my 10 second birthday. Blessed. Help us protect nature. Everything's about nature here. Yeah, so let's go down. So we reached the bottom of the crater. We're gonna throw rocks in it. Just about at the bottom. Echo of stones being thrown into the water. Oh, mine is super excited. Do you see the lake? The lake is frozen, I believe, on the surface. Come on, go on. Throw, throw a rock. No, it did. It did. Did you see that? Did it actually? Bro. Okay, I'm going to end the vlog. When are we rocks? I need to find rocks. But yeah, let's do it. Thank you.